A lot of clouds around, got the winds picking up pretty good out there, and we do have wind advisory for the lower valley. You're starting to see a little bit of a slowdown on westbound lanes of Interstate 2, but remember, there's a lot of construction out there. I think that's all that is. Uh, but other than that, it is going to be breezy, warm, and humid for today, for tonight, and over the coming days, really. All right, so Futurecast is going to show, trying to bring in some breaks in the clouds. Now, we've already started to see those, especially out in Star County. I think we'll see more of that across the area for today, but I do think we'll keep a lot of clouds around as well. So temperatures are going to warm into right around 90 degrees east into the low to mid 90s as you go western. Now this computer model breaks out the clouds quite a bit, even brings in a couple of little showers in from the west for this evening. Uh, I'm not really expecting a whole lot of that. There will be a possibility of some showers and storms further off towards our north uh, this evening and overnight tonight, but for us, Really just the breezy conditions and once the winds come down a little bit this evening, they're going to stay pretty breezy overnight tonight. We'll still see the winds by tomorrow morning gusting up around 35 miles per hour. So you'll definitely be hearing it during the overnight hours. The winds haven't been as strong as you go westward. They're strongest as you go east, closer to the coast you get. And that's going to be the case for the next few days. Now tomorrow, I think we're still going to see the strong winds once again. But they may just stay just a little bit below wind advisory criteria, which will be a good thing, but it doesn't mean they we're still not going to have issues on the roadways as far as especially east west roadways those high profile vehicles wind advisory from now until 7 p.m. and that is for Willacy Cameron County including Laguna Madre and it's in these areas here where we're already seeing the winds pushing close to 40 miles per hour and I still think we could see 40 to 45 miles per hour for this afternoon for this area out towards West Hidalgo County about 30 to 35 miles per hour and Star County about 25 to 30 miles per hour. So diminishes just a little bit as you go westward. The other problem we have today as well is the smoke. Now there's still the agricultural burning down towards our south into central and eastern Mexico and it all pushes northward on those south and southeast winds. So the darker the gray, the thicker the smoke in the upstairs, upper levels of the atmosphere and some of that works its way down towards the surface. And this is going to be the case for a few days at least of those strong south winds. So we do have, once again, an unhealthy air quality alert for the area because of the smoke. So this is going to affect everyone to some extent, but especially those that are sensitive and have respiratory issues. This is going to be a problem. UV index is high. That means your burn time is 30 minutes without any sunscreen and your uh, grass pollen is still showing up on the map in the high category as well. For today, those highs uh, near 90 degrees east, mid 90s westward with those strong south to southeast winds. They'll stay south to southeast overnight tonight and we'll see those temperatures once again very mild in the mid and upper 70s. The same deal we saw this morning and the wind staying up should help us in the visibility category. I don't think we'll have much of an issue with fog out there. Out on the island today, 80 degrees, surf running 74 and 3 to 5 feet. Again, the rip current risk is high. All right, small craft advisor as well until 1 a.m. on Sunday for the coastal waters there. Windy to breezy today, breezy tomorrow, breezy all the way through the next seven days. There's that one little lone rain chance. That's going to be on Tuesday. That's really it. Thank goodness we saw a little bit of rain earlier this week, uh, but we need a lot more. Temperatures going to be pretty consistent near 90 for average high temperatures. That means some areas out west will be warmer. Mid 70s at night, warm, humid, sticky, sticky, warm, sticky, All right. warm, humid. I'm trying to come up with other Crazy. words. Breezy, 